On this show, I think those of you who know the show know that we make fun, we tear down, we ridicule, we destroy, we never build up. That's just what we do. All right, that's great. Now, and I thought, I thought that's great, because I'm, uh, that's my philosophy as well. But uh, I thought that tonight, let's do something different. Let's do something constructive just once that might actually help people. There are a lot of young people that watch this show, and I thought tonight, let's do some practice SAT analogies. Because that would actually help. Might help you guys get a little smarter, huh? Because in that monologue over there, that was scary. And, uh, and, and uh, you know, it might help the kids. And I think old people, too, watching this show right now, it would help them, too. Because your mind's starting to go. You can, if you're watching this program right now, something's wrong. So what I'm saying is let's do some practice SAT analogies. You all know how these work. It's cat is to kitten as dog is to, say it with me, puppy. puppy. That's great. Four people didn't get it. <laughs> uh, I'm glad my parents came. Listen, um, and brought dates. Uh, so you get the idea. That's, that's SAT analogies. Let's try one right now. We'll try a couple, and this will help you. Ancient sarcophagus is to perfectly preserved mummy as fancy English mansion is to anybody? That's right, Keith Richards. That's what works for him. I think that's, that's how they work. That's the basic idea. Here we go. These, these, uh, you'll see. They, they get tougher. Mike Tyson is to threatens to eat children <laughs> as Kathy Lee Gifford is to, anybody? That's right, eats children. <laughs> she does, you can tell. Scientists is to, the human genome map will help us wipe out diseases like cancer and diabetes as Clinton is to, that's right, woohoo, no more clap. Now, I, he's talking like Homer now. All right, uh, 42 million is to opening weekend box office estimate for a scary movie, as 46 million is to, that's right, U.S. Census estimate of number of Wayans brothers. <laughs> I think we've had all of them on the show. All right, uh, folks, here's the next one. Lance Armstrong is to good bet to win Tour de France as Luciano Pavarotti is to, that's right, good bet to split her de pants. Because he's fat. Kids is to love Harry Potter, as Max is to, that's right, loves Harry Hamlin. <laughs> I thought that joke was okay, and then when you went, <laughs> that creeped me out big time. And it's hard to creep this guy out. All right. Al Michaels on Monday Night Football is to a perfect catch by Jerry Rice as Dennis Miller on Monday Night Football is to Hey Karl Marx, why not back off your harpsichord and use your antediluvian brain pan to download a box of ring dings? Cha-cha! <laughs> He's getting his neck fixed. All right, uh, mortals is to can't live forever, as Bob Hope is to, that's right, can't wait to see what ice cream tastes like in the year 4000. <laughs> and then my personal favorite, Monica Lewinsky 2000 is to use his internet site to push handbags as Monica Lewinsky, 1997, is to, that's right, say it with me, used fishnet bra to push up fun bags. Which...
<laughs> we said fun bags. <laughs> All right, here's the plan. And I have a good one. We're going to take a little commercial break right now. When we come back, though, folks, great show tonight. Very funny guy from Cerner Live, Daryl Hammond, going to be joining us. <laughs>